So we would like it to form an integral part of our decision making, but so far we haven't been able to do so in many cases because typically the PR endpoint hasn't been well thought out and the data collection hasn't been as adequate as it should be. And by the time it comes to us, there's typically a large amount of missing data and not a clear objective. So we cannot consider the results robust enough uh, to make a decision on benefit or risk based on the results. I think it is very relevant because it's trying to address precisely this issue of um, aiming to pre-specify ahead of time what are we trying to achieve with the PRO endpoint, what data should be collected and how it should be analysed. So I hope the benefit will be twofold. On the one hand, for patients that are in the trials with the PROs, hopefully if there's a more focused approach as to what data needs to be collected and why, then they won't have to fill in a lot of questionnaires that are then not used. And the questionnaires they do fill in, maybe they'll have the support they need. And for the patients outside of the trials, hopefully we can then use this data for decision making, we can put it in the label of the product, and this, the patients can then look at the information when they're making a decision with their clinicians and look at the patient reported outcomes of the trial.